Alright, hello everyone, Simon here, we're back playing Broken Age and it's not a bug. Right, so so here's what happened. I didn't I wasn't paying enough attention, I guess, although the game kind of went through it really quick. What happened was so we went to Mom to guess the shoe details, we failed twice, and then the game moves Vela back here automatically. And then Vela puts this chart up. This chart is not okay. actually interactable. I just have to put them together to fill out this chart. I mean, we, when you look at this chart, it looks like you should just kind of use it, right? But but the game doesn't do that. This is not actually interactable. This is only to tell you what the clues are and give you a, an idea as to what you need to do. So what I missed was, in fact, Vela automatically walks into this room from the teleporter. That's what I missed. And so walking through the teleporter this way made her head one size smaller. But I've been avoiding those, but I've been using this to go back and talk to mom. So when we came through here, when, well, when the game pulls you through here, that makes her head one size smaller and therefore mom won't talk to you hey, because hey, because your head is not big enough and, and your voice is not deep enough. So that's what I missed. And um... Thank you for traveling with us. Now it's even bigger. Don't push it honey. Come back through me before you pop. Right, normally when you walk through it, walk through the teleport yourself, the game, well, you know, the, the characters tell you how big your head is. But when when we were pulled through automatically, the game didn't say anything. And then there was like half a second of animation, and then I just, I just, I guess I just blinked and missed it. And so then when when I went back to mom, mom wouldn't talk to me because because my head wasn't the right size, and I interpreted that to mean that there's something else I need to do before coming back when in fact it was just my head size not being right. So that was the issue. I think that's a little bit bad design. I think, I mean, it could easily be solved if if they don't have Vela walk through the teleporter. So, you know, between, you know, between talking to mom and going back to the trophy room, the game doesn't automatically change your head size a little bit. That would help. Um, if they made a bigger point of her using the teleporter to go back, that would help. But um, yeah, I, I don't feel like that's fair. I feel like the game is not communicating something quite important there. Anyway, we're just gonna keep continuing. So it doesn't actually stop you from continuing the game. I just feel like it's um, I, I think there's a little lack of communication there. All right, let's go. Hi, it's me, Shay. What was that last question again? I used to make my son new space boots every year until his ninth birthday. He insisted on machine-made boots from the replicator. As he would surely remember, I tried to keep things fresh by never repeating a color or a pattern. So, please tell me what was the color, size, and pattern of his very first space boots. Like, now that I'm listening to her voice more carefully, I can tell that this voice is different from the one before when we tried to talk to mom and she wouldn't talk to us. Um, I, I missed it several times. So maybe that's not as obvious as it as it might be anyway. So it's purple, right? Purple. And the size? And it's size four because it's three sizes smaller than seven, I believe. Size four. And the pattern. And the pattern is polka dot. Polka dot. Done. <laughs> Shay, it is you. <gasps> You're not a computer. You're not Shay. Mom has a massive blonde afro. Oh, who are you? What have you done to our ship? Where's my son? Ah, uh, my name is Bella Tartine. Well, let's just answer the questions first. I shot down your ship. My name is Bella Tartine. I shot down your ship. What? Why? We are an unarmed deep space vessel on a peaceful mission. You are roaming the planet. Who are you? And why have you been kidnapping girls with this ship? Are you insane? Uh, no. Are you? She doesn't have a body. Where, where's, her, where's her guts? Wait a minute, is she a robot? She doesn't actually have a body. 
Where is the big mom computer that controls this ship? Mom computer? What, what are you talking about? She doesn't know that she's a computer, or she doesn't know that she appears like a computer. The wolf told me about you. Okay, now just calm down. You, you need some help. You are not in space. Look at that window. Well, not anymore. You shot us down. No, you were never in space. It's all fake. The stars are on the inside. On the outside, you're a monster. But... She's right, my friend. There he is. That's the wolf I was talking about. That voice. Hey, why aren't you trapped under that junk anymore? I am no wolf, am I, Hope? I'm an old friend. <gasps> Marikai, what are you doing here? I'm here to finish Operation Dandelion for you. I'm sorry that we had to keep some aspects of the mission secret from you and your family. But how are you... You said our world was dying. It was. But then you went forth and found our salvation, as so many have before you. The Mogs. Sorry about the outer space theatrics. Just a precaution to save you from the temptation to go native, as some of your predecessors did. We were never in space? <laughs> no. Laruna is a great empire unto itself, but is part of this very same planet. Beyond the Plague Dam. Funny you should mention that, Bella. Because here we are. Plot twist! Dun dun dun! Plot twist. Now while I prepare the ship for sterilization, you two sit tight and relax. And know that you are contributing to the well-being of many generations to come. Why doesn't she know? Captain! Up here! I'm a weapon! What? Was her, was her name Hope? Was that her name? Why doesn't she know? How can she... Okay, hi. Hey, look, a fork. I'd have a full set if I could just find the... Oh, I wouldn't bring up the S-P-O-O-N if I were you. <gasps> Tiny here broke his heart, so he volunteered for a suicide mission. You shut your mouth, Dutch. Hey, don't worry. I won't tell him who you dumped him for. <sighs> Yikes. There's a little utensil soap opera going on. Why don't you know what's going on? Hey there. Hope? Bella, was it? So, I'm getting the feeling that you weren't behind all these kidnappings. What kidnappings? This ship. On the outside, it's built to look like a monster. <gasps> Every 14 years, a ship like yours comes to a village like mine. And we offer sacrificial maidens to it, so it won't destroy the town. It can't be. And then the monster, your ship, takes some of the maidens away forever. This all sounds so crazy. But it sounds exactly like the kind of scheme the Thrush would come up with. The aliens? What are you? You still don't have a body. Sorry I lied about being your son. The wolf said, well, I'm just sorry. It's okay. I don't blame you. Sounds like Marikai has been fooling all of us for a long time. How can we get out of here? I locked the door manually before, but now I imagine Marikai's locked it himself. Our only hope is if there are systems he's overlooked. I'm going to find a way out of here. Okay. I'm gonna try to think of a way too. All right, cool. You do that, mom. Um, does it? I can click on this. Marikai. Yes. Ah. Uh... Where are you taking us, and why? To the red hangar for processing. Processing, as in like paperwork. Yo, damn! You lied to me. She's not a computer. I never said she was a computer. 
She's not behind the kidnappings. You are. I never said she was behind the kidnappings. You weren't trapped under that junk. I never... Well... <laughs> okay, you got me on that one. I can be a little overdramatic about physical pain. So is that his hair, or is that his head? Why did you shut me into this room? You just shot down our ship, and therefore had to be incapacitated. You're a dangerous girl, Velo. Something tells me we don't even know yet how much. Well, maybe you should, like, drop me off outside and not bring me inside your city. You know, if I'm so dangerous. Are the girls you kidnapped really still on board? Or did you lie about that, too? They're all on board and secured in a safe room. Including you. Is there really a plague on this side of the dam? <laughs> yes, there is a plague, but not in Lerona. The plague is you. And your kind. No offense. Our people are the noble result of thousands of years of rigorous and expensive genetic curation. We built the dam to keep out the genetic plague of the Badlands. Badlands? Again, no offense. How is it Badlands? It's like the most pleasant place in the world outside the dam. If we're a plague, why did you kidnap so many of us? Although it pains me to admit it, you spawns of chaos have something that we lost along the way and have not been able to simulate. Something unnameable and primitive. Maybe even brutish, but essential to our survival. What is it? Maybe you don't understand what unnameable means? So is that his, his head or is that his hair? That boy, her son, what's his part in this? Shay was raised outside of the nurturing atmosphere of Laruna so that he would be, some would say, weak enough, but I would add sensitive enough to select the subjects who fill the holes, as it were, in our collective family tree. This just gets creepier and creepier. Not everyone has the stomach for perfection. Um... I don't know if that hairdo is perfection, bro. We want out of this room. Trust me, it's safer with you in there. How are we safer in here? Oh, I'm sorry. I meant safer to me. I gotta go. Yes, relax and enjoy. Although I am somewhat amused that that's his natural voice, like he wasn't pretending like, that, that wasn't a fake voice he was using to be a wolf. That was, that's actually his voice. <laughs> Alright, so what are we doing here? We got, uh, we got... Okay, so this is not a button. This is part of the... No, it is a button. The screen. Mirakai? Yes? I gotta go. Yes? So this button is also that. That's weird. I gotta go. Yes? Uh... What is this? What's this? Oh, that's just my central control sphere. I used it to keep a watch on the ship. Make little changes here and there. Mind if I try it? Sure. But I'm sure Marikai shut down most of the remote features by now. What? Cool. We are. Better than Oculus Rift. Wait a minute. Oh. Hey, I can cool. see the outside of our door. Looks like the controls have been sabotaged. Really? Oh, if I could just get out there, I'll bet I could fix them. Well, yeah, but if we could get out there, we wouldn't need... Yeah, yeah, I know. But still. Cool. Look at this. Look on the sun. Uh... Ooh. I think I can lock and unlock doors. Yeah, but something tells me not ours somehow. Oh! I guess that sparking panel had its power shut off for a reason. Whoops. Well, now we turned it on. Cool. Let's go into uh We haven't been in here before. Hey, I can see other rooms. Yeah, but probably only the ones Marikai doesn't care about. Uh, you are sad. Hey, cheer up. That's better. Uh, you are happy. Good. <laughs> cool. 
Good morning. Have a great day, Shay. Taco Pil Taco Pill Tuesday. Oh, interesting. Uh, well, there goes your tacos. Sad, happy. All right, we got cereal. We turn this on. What does that do? Wait a minute. It's on a timer though. Okay, we can exit there. Interesting. And then... Alright, that does that. More cereal, please. Nope, cereal is done. Taco Pill Tuesday? Nope, that still goes out. Do we do we really not have cereal? So Alright, we are out of cereal. Hmm. Alright, let's go to the other rooms. Let's see if there's anything else we can mess around with. Let's see what's going on in here. Wow, those arms are strong. Yes, pick that up. Thank you. And now Wait, what are you doing? Oh, I guess it was dirty, but I didn't really need you to Hey, where are you going with that? Those things have a mind of their own. Oh, that's right. We uh we pick him we pick up Shay and then we drop him into the uh the cereal room, right? Hey, cheer up. Everything's going to be Sorry. Oh, well, he's dead. That screen is dead. We just killed that screen. That screen uh is D E D. Someone should really fix that. Doesn't really do anything though, it just kind of um sparks a bit. So is the uh, the door in here now? Yes it is. <laughs> awesome. Go. 